I started looking at, looking at um, all sorts of different weird and wacky concepts to try and improve the Dragon. But eventually we, the main drive came from just being out and having used it and taking bits and pieces of, and doing lots of small improvements in, in a lot of areas to create a, a new product. It was lots of little steps to improve the product. The big improvement is focus on the lobes. So what we looked at here was creating a more robust cam, something that's a real real workhorse which can take take a bit of a beating. So these cams have, uh, have been thickened up and beefed up a bit so they can take a bit of a hammering um, and they can also, they're a bit more resilient if, if you place the cam um, slightly wrong, usually you can't find a perfect placement in reality so these will be a bit more resilient and um, able to, to cope with um, imperfect placements shall we say. Um, another big thing was um, removing the anodizing off here. Obviously a cam um, has a frictional anchor. Um, what you want to do is in improve the friction between the cam and the rock. So we looked at that and we realised that the anodizing on the cam lobe was actually a lot slippier than raw aluminium. So we've, re we've revealed the raw aluminium on the, the face that contacts the rock to improve the, the performance of the cam. The triple grip also helps in um, stability and sideways loading as well. So again, it comes down to your, your imperfect placements. Um, it's a case of every little bit helps really to steal a famous tagline. <laughs> <laughs>